So let's start with the good news. Last week, before the derby, we were told Uguti Umdu Shabalala extended his contract by five years, which shows Uguti they've learned their lesson from what happened with Uplom because apparently Uplom was being monitored and the Chiefs were not even aware Uguti this player is being monitored, which does not make sense because he was playing really well and it made sense Uguti someone would want Uplom. But Tigaga will take the good news Uguti Umtu has extended the contract here, and that means if anyone comes for Umtu Shabalala, and they will, the Chiefs can get more money because the contract extension is by five years. So, good news for the Chiefs. However, let's talk about the people that Chiefs has not replaced. Because we remember last season, we talked a lot about Usnesi Pomali, uh, the guy that they said was fired, but then he came out and he said he was not fired. And that guy was a scout, said Chiefs. And he says that he went around the country with the legendary Donald A. Skuse. So he was a scout, said Chiefs, but at the same time was also given the title Yoguti. He was an analyst. But since he left, I checked to transfer market. I don't see anyone listed as an analyst with technical team here, Chiefs. And that presents a problem because... Each FC plays games, they make mistakes this game, and then they play the next game and they make the same mistake. And then you're like, wait a minute, can't I'm an analyst, are they not giving Uzwane a report to Guti? Wait a minute, we had a problem here and there. And we might have an analyst and I might be completely wrong, but it seems to me like there is a hole that is left there as much as we could have an analyst. But the question is, are they good as the one who was there before because the one who was there before full-time like who was like the leader of of i'm a, I'm a scout chiefs was walter steenbock and he left to do his phd in sports science at the university of johannesburg and there's not been really like a replacement that we had of fuguti this person has come to replace this guy so now it makes you think Uguti. Why would a position that is so vital in the team, why would such a position be left vacant and not be filled immediately? Because when it comes to scouting, it's clear Uguti e Chiefs are just poor at this point. And in fact, even in the past eight years, even in Austin Book, I know Uguti, he was he wanted by Bafana Bafana, Safa wanting him to work for them. But who's been scouting for e Chiefs for the past eight years? And if they look at the players they've scouted, what goes into their mind? Because even now, as we look at who gets scouted and who gets shortlisted to even do our trials with the Chiefs, a lot of those players fail. And then you're like, okay, we know I'm a scout, I'm a scouting, and I'm a, what's this thing? I'm a, I'm a trials are not a short thing. But the failure rate is so high, which means the first filter you go to, who do we even bring? to do our trials is so bad because we are not well scouted if you are enjoying this video please do like it so that more people like you can see it one like per 10 views please 10 percent in your mama like uber 10 percent of likes <laughs> to the video views anyways by liking the video helping me a lot anyways let's continue because the other thing is if i look at Eskose, he is not a scout Say Chiefs, but he's the academy scout. Yes, he's a scout, but academy scout. That's different. So that means he's more focused on the players that by academy Chiefs that are scouted to do the job. And as I hear with Walter Steenbrook, they also went around South Africa. But who's scouting outside of South Africa? Are we just getting these players, these random players that were given? Or is there someone who's actually responsible for that? And also because if we continue and talk about who oh, I'm forgetting, Umli Finzeg. Now Umli Finzeg is also dealing with the development. But there is not one person that we know who today specifically their job is to scout Gui Chiefs. And it shows who there is no such a person. Because if there is such a person, then why is Chiefs continuously scouting poor players or not scouting anyone at all, right? It's a quick, it's a big question that needs to be answered by chiefs and that needs to be addressed because it's clear Uguti 
as much as people will jump into saying the coach this, the coach that, but there are a lot of other problems around the Chiefs. Then there are a lot of problems that needs to be solved if the Chiefs are to do better going forward. If you're still around, please do make sure to share this video on your social media. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you on the next video. And until next time, remember, equals Alpelumoy.